Jennifer McCreeft here. It is a lovely Saturday night, September 4th, 2010. 6 p.m. I'm sitting here on Topsail Beach in beautiful Conception Base, South Newfoundland and Labrador. A bit of a, tri a hat trick here tonight. I was at Little Cove in Kent's Pond earlier today. Amazing, uh, warm, sunny day by our standards here. About I think it hit about 24 Celsius, uh, now it's about 19, it's uh, starting to cloud over here, but uh, lovely day, they've been in for a swim in all three of those locations. Haven't logged in here to have a little uh, chat for a while, I've been extremely busy as of late, uh, doing a variety of things, uh, some of which I uh, prefer not to talk about right now. Um, lots on the go, um, I guess it's good that I've got the energy to literally be busy enough to wear myself out. Um, because uh, earlier this year I did not have energy to do anything. So the fact that I'm still running, going to the beach, networking with friends, trying to start up some non-profit companies, um, trying to lose weight, I've got some, that's a bit of a serious concern for me. I've got surgery coming up on, in January, sex reassignment surgery in Montreal. I've got to lose about 12 pounds to get to the limit of where I need to be in terms of being healthy enough. So. Got my work cut out for me. I'm not really sure exactly how we're going to pull this off, but uh, I think we can figure it out. Uh, careful eating, more and more running. Um, still concerned about my job situation. I've had several more job interviews that have led absolutely nowhere. I'm still employed, but I'm putting file folders on the shelf for a living as opposed to using my brain, which is what I did before I became Jennifer. Uh, definitely not right and not fair. There appears to be immense discrimination here in my job hunt. Um, not to mention discrimination in our healthcare system and our human rights. I'll keep plugging those issues because they still exist. I'm not getting the health care that I need. And uh, I'm still not given human rights protection. I filed a human rights complaint against the health folks. Ironically enough, almost a year ago, the human rights folks are not uh, taking action to deal with that at all. So I'm left hanging here, struggling to survive, shall we say. Um, climbing into debt, not good at all. Um, I'm doing my best to try to keep a positive attitude in life and get outside and enjoy the ocean and the ducks and whatever else may help me take my mind off of my problems. I guess I will open up a little bit about the uh, the other major issue has been how the uh, pride concept in the city of St. John's and how certain folks have kind of taken that over and hijacked it and uh, have kind of been running it. Uh, under the table without being very transparent and accountable. I'm stepping up to the plate with several others to uh, take action to make sure that uh, we can turn pride into what it really needs to be for all of us. Uh, so stay tuned, there'll be more on that. Um, anyways, let's get back to the mountain here, Topsail Beach. Um, we got a, some people walking by there, but uh, they don't seem to be bothering us. It's a phenomenal sight here. You can climb up this mountain, um, there's uh, paths. I've been coming here since I moved here in Newfoundland, 2007. I believe this is my fifth trip here this summer. Wish I could get out here more often. It is far away. It's 16 kilometers from where I live. Um, it's fortunate enough to get a car rental at a very good rate this weekend, so I've got the luxury of traveling around and seeing all my favorite sites, perhaps for the last time before summer concludes on us. Um, but yeah, I just thought I would turn on the camera and uh, enjoy Topla Beach and uh, allow you all to get a look at me one more time. Uh, it's been a while. I usually do these when I'm on the road. Uh, not too many of these at home, so it's nice to be here. By the way, that's Bell Island. Uh, I don't know if you can, how well you can see it on the video out there. Um, rather infamous place. Um, but yeah, this is Jennifer McGreed saying thank you very much for watching and uh, have a good night.